Hi, I'm Tom, and today I want to answer a frequently asked health question, with the one in this video being, when can I fly after having a heart attack? The length of time depends on the likelihood of you having another heart attack. Check with your GP or heart specialist before you fly after a heart attack. They will be able to advise you more specifically. The British Cardiovascular Society recommends that people who have very low risk of having another heart attack may be able to fly as early as three days after having one. You are considered to be at very low risk if this is your first heart attack, you are under the age of 65, you have no complications, or no further treatment is planned. The UK Civil Aviation Authority recommends that people with no complications, who are at low risk of another event, can fly seven to 10 days after a heart attack. If you have heart failure, during the flight, legs and ankles tend to swell and breathing may become more difficult for people with severe heart failure. If you are older than 65 or you've had another heart attack in the past, you're more likely to have one again. If you have no symptoms or other heart conditions and no further treatment is planned, you're considered to be at medium risk. In this case, the Civil Aviation Authority recommends that you may fly from 10 days after your recent heart attack. If you have signs and symptoms of heart failure and further treatment is planned, you are considered to be at high risk of having another heart attack. In this case, you should wait until you are in a more stable condition before flying. Check with your travel operator, airline and travel insurance company before you fly, as they may have their own policies on flying after a heart attack. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, Please like, share and subscribe for more from Health Friendly.